Good Day Collective. This is a overall healing spiritual warfare message for my Taurus Collective. Remember to only take what resonates and leave what does not. Personal readings are available. The links are in the description box. What does my Leo No, my Taurus? So you could be a Taurus dealing with a Leo. Leo could be in your birth chart somewhere. You could be a Leo and a Taurus committed these acts towards you. We'll just see what the universe wants the collective to know at this time for my Taurus collective. Spiritual warfare for Taurus. We have debris, but it's in the reverse. So collective, congratulations. Any type of events that were being set up by low vibrational entities or principalities meant to induce trauma and stress to you. It's in reverse. It's been defeated. Okay? So at this time, you don't have to worry about manifesting a distraction from your priorities. Alright? Stay focused. Your external circumstances are a reflection of your internal circumstances. Please make sure you are using your prayers and affirmations and chants. Okay? The combination of those words is what induces change. And your subconscious, you have some friends, or friends of friends, either way it go, somebody went and decided to make a friend that with someone that was low vibrational. This person's family members have already been banished from being able to do work on your sacral chakra anymore, collective. So that's why you're manifesting beautiful circumstances for yourself externally and focused on your priorities. Your ancestors are going to show you who and who not to talk to or who and who not to clap for. Any other spiritual warfare messages from our Taurus Collective? Make sure you're writing your petitions to your ancestors and high vibrational um, deities that you work with or that work with you, okay? There is a coven group of people. You could have been being gang stalked and that energy is being clear. Make sure you are also purifying your energy so you don't have any rips, okay? Someone that was interested in you, maybe you were not interested in them, did try to uh, put an entity on you through some shape, form, or fashion. But they did not realize that you are elemental healing. And they're having some mental health problems, okay? This could be an ex of yours. This could be somebody you turned down. This could be the interest, your interest, their karmic person or something like that, or their friends. Yeah, somebody that you're interested in. So Taurus, you guys have somebody that you're interested in. They have friends that gang stalk people. The deliberate events that these friends have induced in other people to allow entities and outside forces to take over, that's not in your energy field. It's going back to these people. Okay? So your person or your soulmate or even you yourself friends, friends of friends, etc. are about to have a lot of events that cause trauma for them, okay? It, it can have to do with their family members as well, alright? But mainly worry about this. This is how you'll know who's part of covens. This is how you'll know who gang stalks people. People do get paid to, to stand people. But as this is being cleared, these people, these groups of people are about to experience traumatic events in their life. Entities are about to take over their family members. Their finances are going to get ruined. The practitioner, it was a practitioner involved. That person is about to go through it. They've already been blocked. Someone can expect a situation to go through involving court. They're going to be getting that message. Someone could be getting sued for a uh, substantial amount of money. Oh, they could be getting sued for a house. 
What's the prayer affirmations? What does my Taurus collective need to know about prayer affirmations? You're an official person, so your prayers and chants and affirmations, your word magic is going to work. Your word magic is going to work, collective. So if you want to write a petition, speak on protection regarding you, your loved ones. You can you can expect to receive that protection. Be careful of the words that you're speaking. You're speaking, you're creating things in existence for yourself and others. Uh, a group of people are now sick because they're realizing I like really am of high honor. They're getting that message now. So you don't have to worry about if you, you know, tap into my channel or get a personal reading for me. If something's going to happen regarding your reading or anything like that. My energy is very, 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 very high. Okay. Setting wealth over here. Energetically. Anybody that tries to steal that or replicate it, copycat it, they're going to cause a disaster for themselves, okay? I can't find what I'm looking for, but that's okay. Let's get back to this reading. What does the Taurus Collective need to know about this debris in reverse? Debris in reverse? Yeah, don't be concerned. Everything around you is fine. Your external circumstances is not something you need to be concerned about at this time, Taurus Collective. What's the friends? What does the collective need to know about these friends? Could be a current or former friend. Or friends of the attacker. Or someone got recruited. We have judgment. So these people are going to be going to physical court in some way, shape, form, in a fashion. And it's going to have to do with a housing situation. Someone could be um, going to jail for harming a child. Someone did have a child to get out of spiritual jail to like pass that trauma and karma energy into a child. Somebody got pregnant to do that on purpose. They're going to be in poverty. And that's going to be justice and balance and karma for interfering with someone's relationship. Halfway. Somebody's in despair because they've lost all of the gifts that they did have to use to get money. They can't anymore. It makes them sick. Someone's physically ill. Nobody wants to talk to this person. Nobody wants to be friendly to this person. Nobody wants to be kind to this person. This person did some things in the spiritual realm that was not part of Akashic Records. So covens, communities, organizations, they're losing all of their energy and vitality. Divine masculines are waking up now. The karmic feminines that are still holding on to ancestral patterns from their male ancestors, they're about to go to jail one way or another. Spiritual jail, physical jail. It's a lot of 22 through 24 year olds that did energy harvesting, got paid to gang stalk people and do witchcraft on them and things like that. They're about to experience a lot of situations involving the police and also other kinds of... Uh, the spiritual police, basically. They're reprobate. They don't get messages from God. They don't hear God. They don't see God. That's why they don't have any fortune whatsoever. They're false people. Keep your distance from single, bitter, divorced women. Keep your distance from men and women that feel like love doesn't exist. Stay focused. Divine Masculines, stay focused on your thoughts. Only positive thoughts. Positive thoughts only. Even when it comes to the female collective. Not all women are gold diggers. Not all women are bums. Just pay attention to the signs. 
We want to deal with somebody. And Divine Feminine, your spiritual reputation is known, so you embody that, that energy. That's in your aura. It's officially part of your signature. Everywhere you go, they know who you are. Karmic feminines are about to lose everything. All the energy that they've stolen, whether these karmics are masculine or feminine, rich or the lost money already, it's about to get worse for them. What does the Taurus Collective need to know about ancestor support? Empresses, save your money. Empresses, be creative with your speaking and with how you're thinking. Even when it comes to the king of swords and the upright man in your life. There is a... <clears throat> Capricorn that's reassessing the investments that they've made involving the Pisces what does the collective need to know about ancestor support Taurus collective what do they need to know about ancestor support Be resilient, have courage, stand in your power. Your ancestors is very, very strong. They move very, very fast. Some people's ancestors are using the justice system and other <laughs> high vibrational entities that are masters at what they do to send these entities and black magic back to where whoever sent them expeditiously. It's, it's coming to the empresses in reverse and to the queen of cups in reverse someone wants to go to their childhood home or someone did go to their childhood home because they're under judgment and they felt like maybe that could help them heal some type of issues but that just caused a lot more drama because whatever scandal these individuals were spreading on divine people and concerning a divine person with this covenant group was exposed that they're narcissists they're liars they're not really healers they're just takers not givers they putting that ass to rest some people have realized doing blood magic blood spells using potions and elixirs to harm people and make people sick yeah that was independent of them because maybe they started off doing it on karmics but when you're divine if you start poisoning other people that is going to make you karmic it doesn't matter if the other person is divine or not that's not your call to call on putting someone to rest you leave that to the universe if the, if the situation comes up and it's about protecting yourself the universe already has you protected people are blind blindsided people were not paying attention to the signs like i said earlier and they did not Past go basically with this Saturn and return Saturn and Aquarius energy already. I'm I am unapologetic given given this message to people that abuse spirituality. <clears throat> Ancestors are unapologetic. What he said, had to put my stick in a box. With the page of swords and the page of wands. Yeah, my messages are real. And they are being seen internationally. Ace of Pentacles. A lot of people are emotionally immature and their telepathic abilities have been cut off due to overindulgences, whether that's spending money, whether that's just being selfish in general, which this covenant groups, people were being selfish, wanting other people to have painful endings. 
that was selfish of this covenant group. That's why these ancestors is not, they not fucking with it. What's the covenant groups? What does the Taurus collective need to know about covenant groups? The Knight of Cups. I feel like collective, you can be empathetic, but don't be sympathetic. Because it is young men out here, water signs, that their emotions is like Neptune in reverse type of energy. But it's because of the women that they learned how to communicate from. Someone's realizing that their mother and their father, they had the Ten of Pentacles at some point in time, but they lost it. They went the wrong way and they made very immature decisions. They worked really fast to interfere with apologies, pregnancies, and people's emotional growth. And that's what's coming out. So divine people, you're going to continue getting Wheel of Fortune in your moment. You're going to be able to find the right ways to balance your priorities. Someone is having dreams of marrying a soulmate. And someone's watching that person. So if you're a king of wands, feeling heart, heartache and pain and betrayal, because people interfere with your Saturn return, but you realize you're getting a transformation, but you have to work on not being a narcissist. And that comes out when you're really, really depressed. So when you're feeling the lowest of your vibration, you know that's judgment. But with judgment, it's a what's next. It's the ending. You have to transform that energy into love. You have to make the choice to release heartache, losses, and grief. And just accept that you played some type of part, whether it was with word of mouth, that was immature, it wasn't practical. That'll get you back in an energy of the number 66. If you are into numbers, look up the number 66. If you are family members or friends with this covenant group energy, you have to be empathetic through the energy of number 66. What does the Taurus Collective need to know about purifying? What does the Taurus Collective need to know about purifying? Also, if you know magic is being thrown at you and you put up protection, clearing your energy, spiritually leveling up, return to sender, your protection when you're doing banishing spells will also release the low vibrational energies. But it's automatically being returned to sender as you meditate and just clear negative energy. You don't have to actually do it like, you know. Somebody is getting the message that their death magic is being returned back to them. That person could be a fire sign. This fire sign is very upset with a Pisces. The Pisces is an energy vampire and drinks a lot. What, about, what else about this Eight of Wands in reverse? What does the Taurus Collective need to know about the Eight of Wands in reverse for spiritual warfare? Use your intuition, okay? Use your intuition. This return to sender energy is going back towards homes, relationships, and marriages of the friends, of the people within this covenant group if energy was stolen from these people and they were actually divine d-i-v-i-n-e they're going to get new opportunities like ace of pentacles energy they're up on higher ground so that's why it's important for you to stay in a high vibration at all times because you don't know who your friend know who knows who who knows who connected to these friends and covens and groups let's get to the rips what is it? It was the it's the seven of swords. Somebody's lying, even though they've already been caught, um, in, involving trauma, inflicting trauma to an individual. Somebody purposely did send an entity 
to try to mind control and manipulate somebody. Knight of Wands and Ten of Wands. But somebody ended up getting really, really hurt. It was due to spell work. So that type of energy that was being sent out is going back. This pra Either the practitioner is watching right now or you're connected to that practitioner. It could be a Libra. Connected to a Cancer Pisces Scorpio that didn't pass their Saturn return because they were being manipulated. So, my Taurus Collective, that was your spiritual warfare message. Please allow this message to help you get to calmer waters in a Six of Swords energy. Keep practicing and mastering how you're raising your vibration. Remember that healthy thoughts are create health choices, okay? So whenever you're in the Two of Swords, when you're in the Two of Swords and your thoughts are moving very, very quickly, you need to get to the, the truth of those deeper emotions, thoughts, and feelings. Only then can you release that energy with the hangman in reverse with the ten of swords. Okay? Please do not worry about karmic females doing any type of spell work. It's not working. It's only backfiring on them. Is some karmic females that think they are the high priestess because they have a group of people worshiping them. Come on now. Males and females. If you have a group of people following you that you're influencing, it could be it's a king of wands, male or female though. That's really in the energy of thinking they control the situation and they don't. So collective, be conscious of yourself and others, okay? And I'll talk to you later. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.